All right, hello and welcome everyone. Before we get started with today's video, today's video is sponsored by Discord Nitro. For those of you who are unaware, Discord Nitro is a $10 a month service that not only supports Discord, but also offers a large library of games and game perks like the one we're going to be talking about for Warframe today. These are offered every month and range from big bundles like the one we're talking about today and smaller perks like boosters. And in addition to that, for those of you that use Discord as your main communications platform, as you probably should because it's great uh that also offers a bunch of bonuses there like animated avatars and stuff of that ilk so if you guys don't have discord nitro you can sign up with it on the uh, link in the description below and also there is another link in the description to the community discord for the channel as it were where i hang out in there and so do a bunch of other people so if you're looking for people to party up with in warframe and maybe use some of the boosters that are coming in these bundles you can head there and do that so Without further ado, thanks again to Discord for sponsoring this video, and let's jump into it. Okay, hello and welcome again, everyone. So this month's pack is actually on Saren. It is a bunch of stuff for Saren, and I've been wanting to do a beginner build thing for Saren for a little bit. So this kind of gives me a good excuse to do that and also talk about some dope cosmetics. So first and foremost, we of course have Saren here in her Orphid skin, which is in the Discord pack and is honestly like, okay. So just to like quickly talk about how this skin was made better. So they added the, the dual colors here for the energy and all this extra customization stuff. Here's the really good thing on this skin. So this skin has like these like metallic ish parts that you can see have this like brown in it that I've put in here. This color meshes with the other colors you have customized on to Saren. So before you couldn't get like this effect. You, you could not get this effect on this skin previously. This is new to this skin because of the way they changed emissives and stuff. Like it, it is way, way more like fine tooth comb customizable with how you want this stuff to look. And you can see that like this yellow is like up in the, the upper portions here, or it becomes a yellow up in the upper portions and you use orange in this slot anyway. And then you can still see the green on the bottom and it's like not, it's really, really hyper customizable, like the uh, the Orphid skin. And I did not realize this before I started messing with it for the purposes of this video. And it's way, way better than it used to be. This skin, I was actually originally, back in time, pretty disappointed with. Um, because I just liked the Tenogen on Saren better. Uh, and like I just liked Saren Prime better. But with the color updates, it makes it so, so much easier to get a look on this skin that looks great. Also, this, the embolist parts, actually don't look awful on this skin, which is pretty rare. Like the embolist shoulder pieces, because her shoulders are like already kind of like mismatched in terms of like what's on them, because of course she's got her big flower. The embolist uh, arm plates actually work pretty well, I think. Um, like I would probably definitely use the one on the right the one on the left maybe is like changeable out with other pieces but the one on the right definitely like melds into just how Saren looks and works well and so do the leg pieces I think with this skin so that's all cool embolist armor is of course also in this bundle and there's a Saren noggle uh and thing I did not end up putting on here because I just don't think this skin really really needs a Sindana but it is a decent Sindana is the Samia Sindana it's cool it's fine if you want a cape for your warframes this is a good one to do it's the only good one that's not a tenogen one as it turns out um and it looks fine but i personally just like the cool like dual color skirt thing that this skin has going on and you can't really see it if you equip that sandana so there's that besides that there is a seven day resource drop chance booster in this bundle which is very useful of course naturally don't think i need to go over that very much but let's talk about Saren herself because I haven't I've talked about like how good Saren is because obviously she's fucking great but I haven't really gone into like how on a low level to use Saren so this is a zero forma Saren build and for the purposes of showing off the skin that you also get in this pack with the dual blade skin is the this what is it called again it is the dual sword Siskis skin this skin Super cool, looks really nice with the new energy effects, especially whenever you customize the colors in a, you know, I think I think it's a, I think it's a pretty decent color customization, personally. I think it looks nice, um, but this can go on any dual swords. So I just decided to go with the Twin Croker. The Twin Croker are like, 
a little high investment to make but they're also only mr6 so you can build them really really early uh and worth noting on the build for the twin croaker this is a two form of build but i'm gonna show you guys the secret this is this is a big this is a big secret don't tell nobody if you want to reduce the forma investment on a weapon like this that's using condition overload usually boom no forma needed done and done this is the build in fact i'm not even going to put that back on we're just going to show what this does without that so if you want to go on a significantly lower forma investment you can absolutely do that does not need condition overload will it make it better absolutely it will because we're using Saren, and Saren loves condition overload are there better weapons than this that you could build obviously you could go build the kamakuris reaper is that a huge investment absolutely it is twin croaker going to be a lot easier a uh, little shopping list to put together besides that though the actual Saren build that we've got here is this this is basic as fuck now here here we go with some some different change morounds if you don't have th certain things Augur Reach. This mod, a little bit of a pain in the ass to get. Not gonna lie. You can just take that out. Don't worry about it. Put whatever you want in here. More health. Don't care. Do you not have regenerative molt? Okay, that's fine. Don't absolutely have to have regenerative molt. However, it will make it so you do pretty much absolutely have to have rejuvenation here because Saren really needs at least some kind of healing physique and using rejuvenative molt on her is like gonna or regenerative molt sorry is gonna be way better because regenerative molt is just much better and even beyond regenerative molt although this is not a beginner thing you can of course use operator arcanes to heal really really quickly but regenerative molt works great great for beginners not that hard to get a hold of if you have any kind of a person who is a acquaintance to you who is in any of the syndicates they'll probably be like oh what are you new to the game here take this like just yeah i just have this i don't care that's usually how that goes for a lot of people so just ask phone a friend see if they got a regenerative molt for you probably yes probably do so try and do that uh besides that though uh you could honestly just leave a slot open Saren is like immensely powerful but of course i am going to show it uh with the auger reach in here you could just throw auger accord in here if you really wanted to throw some shields on Saren doesn't matter that much obviously between vitality and physique i have over a thousand health on this warframe and that's going to be more than enough for most content but let's test this against some content that you have almost exactly no fucking chance of seeing if you are a new player getting this bundle just to see how hilariously strong it is so we're just going to take this test at level 80 because we're using Saren and we can we can just do that are you going to run into level 80 enemies with a build as like hilariously low investment as this probably not unless you're really trying to uh but let's shred them let's just let's just murder these fools like it's our job because it kind of is I guess so you put your three on put your one on an enemy hit your enemy with your your melee weapon of choice usually usually you want to hit four at some point during that and get like a kill just murder this enemy right here real quick and then you've got your corrosive procs like eating the armor and like just absolutely being horrifying in every conceivable possible way you could throw down a regenerative molt just to heal like this enemy's dead this enemy's being eaten alive by our corrosive procs like just 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 murder happens like are are the dual blades like super efficient and like super high range no but we only need to hit an enemy like once for them and everyone they've ever loved to die because we're playing as Saren. So, yeah, Saren's really, really good. I don't, I don't know if I've, if have I made that apparent? Is it obvious yet that like Saren's pretty strong? Cause she's, she's pretty good. But yeah uh thank you to discord again for sponsoring this video it gave me a good excuse to show off like what like low investment like putting nothing into it Saren looks like uh for anyone that was curious if you should definitely have a Saren in your arsenal uh but yeah once again if you want to just get the bundle and not have to farm Saren and or or even if you already have discord nitro you just have this it's literally waiting for you if you just go like click the link in the description or sign up for that and then get that and a bunch of other Warframe stuff. It's all good. Uh, but yeah, this is this has been a, a weird video. 
because at some point it stopped being super instructional because I have that very nice everything Saren video that kind of goes over how it works. And this is the low investment destroy everything version of that. So, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you tomorrow.